Hey, what's up everyone? It's your friend 23 here, and we're back with another episode of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. We ended with talking to Tiba and Saki and their son Tulin, who was a bit rebellious and flew off. And Tiba here told us we should talk to his friend over at the fires. He had some lodge or something there. But before we do that, I really want to climb this mountain somehow. Just to see if we have some some secret loot up here. Would not make me surprised if it were. So let's first see if we can use the upheaval, and we could, which is nice. Saves us roughly five minutes of climbing and frustration. This is such a Oroko seed spot somewhere here. That was just straight mountain, right? Yeah. Maybe it's too obvious of a spot for Kuroko seeds. Maybe out in the tip here. When we should also fly and just unlock this map. Then it would be easier to to navigate. Maybe this stone over here. That should be a Kuroko. It feels way too purposely placed. I did. Bye bye. Boom. Okay. So the fires is also over there. So let's just start the quest line and then go up there after. My dude, what is this stuff? You tell me, dude. Ah. We found these strange things at the foot of Hebra Mountains. They are oddly shaped, aren't they? Mm. I've done every test I can think of, but I have, haven't learned anything. Not even what they're made of or what they're for. All I know is that they're pretty heavy and pretty sharp. It probably hurt if you got hit with one, huh? Well, I got all... Well, I've got all I'm going to get out of some of these things. If you want them for some reason, it, they are all yours. Dude, thank you. I will uh, leave your uh, flint and wood so you don't freeze to death. This is something new. Chill shroom. Uh, used to allow you to stay cool in hot areas. And I'm gonna break these. Oh, I took a flint, sorry. I hope you will manage to not freeze to death. That works as a landmark. Oh. Hey there, are you here because you spotted the bonfires? The blizzard makes it hard to see where you're going, so we keep these bonfires going as a beacon for lost travelers. They eat up a lot of firewood, but it's worth it. You can spot them even from up in the air. Though, as proud as I am of them, they can't beat the spotlight set up around the fancy skyview tower. That's true. I like the raid. Mm -hmm. It won't warm you up like a bonfire will. But it's hard to beat it for size and sheer brightness. That's true. Oh. The Highlands... The Highlands are pretty incredible to have built something so impressive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And here we have... Something. Probably the dude we're gonna talk to. Read a book about this. Actually, I'm not that invested in a child song's lore. Link, you're all right. I worried after I heard that you had gone missing. What happened? I like your haircut, uh. also, dude. That's so stylish. Uh, ah, so you're looking for Princess Zelda. Sorry to tell you that I haven't heard anything about her. Our feathers are full, dealing with a more immediate problem. 
Everyone from the village has left to scavenge the food or to investigate the cause of the terrible blizzard. And all of that has been hampered by the sky monsters that seem to be everywhere. We spread too thin to deal with them probably properly on top of everything else. Sorry bud, wish I could do more for you. Though, now that I think about it, maybe Tulin could help. I believe in Tulin. Oh right, you weren't around for it, but little Tulin has developed a way with wings that puts the adult to shame. Even in the vicious weather, he patrols the skies and reports all kinds of useful oh. information. His wind gust technique is something to see. None of the rest of us can pull it off. Even stern Tiba acknowledges that Tulin's skill is a cut above. Mm. The kid does preen about it more than he should, but well, it's worth asking him at least. Last I saw him, he was with Jisan and La Lysa on on a trip to find food. I think they were on their way to Hebra South Summit Cave, that's to the northeast from here. The cave is past the cliff out front and up the mountain road. There should be a bonfire marking the spot. Let's go there ah. then. Find the bonfire at the mouth of the cave and you'll be on your way to finding Tulin. Now we need to read this because who knows. Stormwig Arc Legend. One day the wind, winds that ought to blow in Rito Village ceased. Then the, he, the heavens grew stagnant and the earth fell to ruin. The villagers looked skyward for solution. They saw a figure, blah blah blah. Yeah, I'm not gonna read all that. I have talked too much already. But I guess we're gonna talk to this chick. Uh, Amali. I'm drawing up a special menu for those out scavenging for food or investigating. Ingredients are hard to come by in this blizzard, but we'll be fine if we get a little creative with our cooking. With the right ingredients, a little food can go a long way. For example, a pinch of spicy pepper warms you up so you don't notice the cold so much. We don't have many of them here, but you are welcome to what's available. In tough situations like this, everyone needs to look out for each other's, each other and help where we can. Okay, I maybe shouldn't take their whole supply when I also have 22 of them, so I'm gonna do you a a bigger one. I'm gonna drop five, so you actually gain one by me coming here. And I'm not gonna steal anything more from you guys. I already took one flint and that's enough. Ebra mountain climbing path. Oh. Oh. The question is, should we do the tower first, and then go and do the quest? I was just wondering why the yellow dot was there, but that's because we we, we should find the, the cave, I guess. And that's the cave. That wasn't as hard to find as I thought it would be. Let's try to get a spot here so we can ascend, so we don't have to climb everything. Let's try here soon here. Maybe we don't even need to ascend. No, that's not gonna work. But we're already up, so... We didn't even need it. That's nice. And here we do want to fly over all these spikes, so I'm gonna climb a bit more, just to gain some height, and then we're just gonna glide in. I guess that's enough. That's perfect. Ooh. We could have probably just burned these up as well, but now we're here. Nice. 
starting to unlock a, a lot of the map now. Nice, nice. Any mount? Oh, that's a big, uh, big storm. Sky map up updated. And also, let me just open the sky map quickly here. This looks like a uh, balloon of some sort, but it's it's an island, right? Okay. So quickly, just mark these things that we can see from here. I think I saw one more, or am I mistaken? I guess we want to investigate over here. We have one enemy. Is that it? There we have those boss type. Oh, there we have one. Oh, wrong button. We're gonna leave these Sky Islands for now. Let's continue with the quest. I'm feeling the quest for this episode, actually. We need to advance a bit on the quest line. You can get lost on sidetracking things. Way too easy here. And I have already done that too much. In this playthrough, I think feel like. Are we getting sidetracked again? Uh. A cave in? You gotta be kidding me! How am I supposed to get inside now? Dude, I will help you. Well, take a gander for yourself. <sighs> I was hauling food out out of there when the entire and en when the entrance collapsed. Now what do I do? I should have picked some bomb flowers from the other cave. Could have used them to blow these rocks away. What a fool's luck. I hate to leave all that food behind, but maybe I just need to call today a wash and come back tomorrow. Dude, I will help you, dude. You don't need to call call it for today. That's nice, and then we're gonna actually do a bomb barrel. Because that stone felt a bit deep. Back up. Because we don't wanna die. Yeah, see, it's even deeper, so... <laughs> That's good. That would have taken forever to... To just... Wow, look at the cave. <laughs> hey, those rocks didn't know what hit them. You're amazing. Now I can bring some supplies back to the village. Thank you too much. All right, I need to reward you somehow. You don't have to because <laughs> your life situation oh. looks a bit more rough than mine at the moment. All right, I'm going to check if that food is still good. Thank you for opening the path for me. You're welcome, dude. You're welcome. Nice. Sometimes it's like a, a small entrance behind these, so I'm gonna just secure that so I don't miss something. And there you are, sticky lizard. Soon I don't need you guys, but I still do need you. For now at least. Ah, that's a shame. Take this instead. Boom. And I recovered the bomb bombs I used to blow that up. Ah. The food. Thank you for helping to keep our food supply intact. I delivered them to the village as soon. Ah. I know where Tulin is, so I'm not gonna ask him. I just feel like unnecessary talking. Maybe we can reach them from this cave also. Depends on how deep the cave is. 
Oh, there you have one of these guys. Oh, that's bad. Let's just secure it with an eyeball. I really love the homing... The homing uh, arrows. It's a bit cheesy and shitty, but... It's nice. A bubble gem. And that's a quest line I also need to finish, because those dudes that wants the, the the dude that wants the bubble froggy thingy. Good luck escaping this. Chili trout, heat resistance. Nice. Let's go and find Tulin now. This is some new kind of berry. They look super good. Or delicious. I would eat these. Ice fruits. Increase attack power in cold temperatures. A fruit and a cold one struck. Okay. This one you can uh, probably do arrows with, and then you can cook them for something. Ooh. What do you want or need? Unbelievable that these huge things are raining down on us. What What is happening up there in the skies? Hmm, oops. I didn't expect to meet a highland here. What are you doing in the mountains in this weather? Don't you see how cold it has gotten? Our feather keep out the worst of it, but I'm not sure how you can stand in a blizzard. I have the cold resistant on me, you know. If you go further up the slope, you'll see Hebra South Summit Cave. My friends are there now gathering provisions. There are glowing mushrooms and fish to be had, which come in handy. They keep a bonfire stoked at the cave entrance to mark their location. If the cold gets too much for you, find that bonfire and warm yourself up in the cave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the thing is, wasn't it a cave here somewhere? Did I think I saw the... Ah, oh, it's it was that fire I saw and I thought that would be the cave. So we should keep on going upwards here, I guess. And I wonder if those fly th flying thingies are... No, it's just regular bats, right? But with frozen abilities instead. Oh, that's a bad... That's even worse. <laughs> That's even worse. Like in between them. Nice. Hey, we got one at least. Can you aggro me or something? No? Ice skin ice balls. So are they homing? They're only homing. Freezing frost when stimulated. Don't let this... So will those freeze? Let's just try one. I know I only have two, but... Why not? I only have one, even. I just wanna see what it... Yeah, it, it freezes. <laughs> Got a lot of ice fruit out of that, so it's... I would say it was worth. Boom. Then quickly run to, to these frozen dudes. Boom. Are you still frozen? They're probably frozen forever because we're in the cold climate. That's some great uh, knowledge to keep in mind.
Feathered edge. A double edge Rito sword with a decayed blade as everything else. Swing it. Produce a strong wind. Okay. Let's try it. That's a bit weird. Ooh. No. Oh, yes. Do we have anything for our movement speed? I have. There looks like the big fire. We made it! Ibra South Summit Cave. Let's talk to this. Lysa. Didn't think I'd be seeing anyone else in these mountains anytime soon. What with the blizzard and all. I'm here because it's a good place to find food for my people. Why are you here? I'm here to help you all. Looking for tooling, huh? Fair enough. It's uh, farther in the cave with uh, Jisan. They're scavenging for food. No, I'm not going to show you the way. I need to keep an eye on what we as amassed so far. Be on your guard. There are creatures in the cave that hops around on the wall. I know. It probably won't bother you if you stay away from it. Good luck finding tooling. So will these... I... I have a vague memory of that these, like, burn. <laughs> Thought it would be probably be spikes in the air there, uh, on the roof, and I was correct. I could have gone badly. The thing is, do we wanna break this? I want to. I'm not sure if that was the correct thing to do. I guess I can just ascend, so it didn't matter much. Let's just get this loot. And I see the lizards, but I know every time I drop them in the water, they usually just end up not being there anymore. Okay, are we done here now? It seems like it. So, ascend, please. I'm gonna find this dude wherever he is. Oh, I have forgotten his name already. Was it Tatsu or something like that? So we're going up and we don't want to die from the spikes. Okay, here we don't have spikes. Here we can actually just cruise. Where is the entrance there? Nice. Wasn't it here I came from? Yeah, it was. <laughs> Oopsie. Ah, oh, there is the correct entrance. Oof. That could hurt. I'm gonna keep picking up the stones, because I feel if, if I don't keep up, uh, pick up everyone, then the ones I don't 
Pickup will be the one that has uh, that has um, <laughs> Coroco seed in it. What did he drop? Just a regular uh, wood spear. Nothing I need or want. Is it windy here? No. They want me to create wind, if I could take a guess here. Oh my god. Okay. Throw... Flint. Why does flint has to be like all the way to the end? Boom. Then we need a steel weapon of some sort. Yes, this is good. And then we need those... Um, those high 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 rule uh, what was they called high rule uh, something something my blind blind uh, 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 uh. where are you dude they're pine cones and then we just drop it there Boom. Thank you for bringing some air to me. Did we miss anything fun? We have something over here. I guess we just throw a fire fruit. Oh, we have those also. Uh, let me just snipe it with my... Aimbot. This cave was really, really deep. Oh, boom, boom. It's great that we found this spike club earlier. It makes this cave a lot easier to clear out. Because the durability on this one is crazy. I was like, is this where we were before? No, that's Tulin. Ah, oh, this is uh, Jess, Jess, Jessan. Jessan. Uh, what are we going to do with that boy? It's just like him. It's just like him to fly off on his own and leave all the food we collected behind. Oh. Well, I'll be. What is a Highland doing all the way up here in such a fierce blizzard? Mm. You're here to talk to Tulin, eh? You, you just missed him, unfortunately. Our task was just to scavenge food in this area, but we just saw a flock of monsters fly, fly past outside the cave. The same ones that have been sight, sighted around the village lately, in fact. I told the others we should return right away to report them, but Tulin clearly wasn't listening at all. He said, I'm gonna follow them back to their nest and flew off alone before I could protest. This damn Tulin. If you leave the cave and head north, you can spot a lone cedar tree on Talonto Peak. That's where we saw the monsters. No doubt Tulin followed them there. Mm. I know he thinks he's unbeatable, but he's really should be but he sh really shouldn't be taking these chances. That is true, my dude. When you're a teenager, you can be a bit uh, stupid sometimes, thinking you're like the most grown up and uh, mature person, and then you do stupid mistakes. Oh, 
snowball from nowhere just came rolling down. So some big cedar tree, he said. Oh, and we also need to help this dude. Can we use the snowballs somehow? We can. That's actually great. We can build them maybe. We should build a snow snowman. You have my support. No 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 damn That was not the best Maybe Oh that's not gonna be enough I'm unsure what we should support these beams with we like have nothing of building power. God damn. Can you just stay in place? Let's try the stone instead here. the ball grew from the snow if we do it like that that should be enough ah! you're crazy like putting up signs here who is gonna read this sign nice so let's just collect our rewards and then keep going Your help, blah, 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 blah. First, take this, then take some food, and thirdly, take a special get little gift. A puff room, thank you. Okay, you're off, bye bye. Can I do something with this? If we... Oh my god. Yeah, that's the thing I wanted to do. Okay. I'm not sure what to do with those. Here we have some enemies. Let's just... Give them a blast to begin with. Oh, my thingy burns. That's no good. Where is that cedar tree they were talking about? I guess it's that one. Ah, yeah. oh, I missed the chest also. A swallow bow. With quick draw, that's awesome. Uh, so ascend up this little mountain, maybe? Perhaps? Yes? Nice. Oh, that's a lot of enemies. And that's the big dude. But we have a lot of freezing materials, so we should just... We should start with a blast. Oh, as always. It's always good to start with a blast. Oh. And then quickly apply a freezy jelly. Boom. Wrong. Uh, wrong thing. Throw it. I froze myself. 
Okay. Because we're at the cold landscape here, they will never spawn or defreeze if I don't let them. Nice. That was a quick little fight. So if, if I remember correctly, wasn't that the guy I had a lot of troubles with when we unlocked the first sky... Uh, what's it called? The sky... sky towers. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's keep ascending. Wonder what these big uh, platforms are. And this, can I destroy those? Probably with fire, maybe. Yeah. But it looks like it's just an enemy inside. Oh my god, this will take forever. And use up all my fruits. Yeah, that was an enemy. Maybe he has a nice weapon on him. Icicle club. I'm gonna take it. Uh, 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 what should we drop? I guess we should drop this one. That's a nice little spear. <laughs> okay. Can we find tooling up? Yeah. And also, do you think something is in the top of this tree? It wouldn't surprise me if it were. Yeah. Okay, let's use the extra energy we have. I see a Koroko one. Yeah. Yay! Should have kept my guard up. Stupid monster. What? Link, where did you come from? What happened? Oh, uh, you see, that rotten monster took my good bow. Damn. See, that's the bow napper. We will help you get that bow back. I gotta get it back, help me out. Sure, dude. Really, thanks. Did you know I can blow a strong gust of wind anywhere I feel like? I did not know that. I'll do it for you too, that way you can glide over there uh, uh -huh. The monster went. Just tell me where you point the gust and I'll make it for you. Tulin's power of wind. When Tulin's aura is charged, he can create a stream of wind that blows straight forward. This can be used for burst of speed while paragliding. Nice. That will help us uh, explore a lot quicker as well. Okay, let's go, dude. I want the gust to go that way. Okay, I want to get some aggro, so I'm going to do an aimbot shot. Is that a one-shot kill? Nice. Oh. There we go. I owe you a big time, Link. Without you, my bow might have been lost for good. Uh-oh. Three more, huh? And they come with Boko... Boko blins. There's more of them. Alright, they're not gonna make a fool out of me twice. Let's get them together. Let's do it, boy. First of all, get a better shield out. Oh wow, this, uh, this is actually a great sword. I shouldn't use it here. I should save it. <laughs> and they fall over, that's great. For a troll weapon. Nice. We did it! Yay! 
Hey, look, I think uh, this might have been a hideout for those monsters. Oh. Hmm, was that the wind? It could have been, there's... It couldn't have been, there's no way. It must have been something else. Oh, hey, Tulin, Link. Huh? Is it mommy and dad? Oh! Oh, no, it's uh, his friend. Yeah, yeah, this guy. With the great hair. Oh. That was some impressive teamwork, you two. Ah, you saw that, Hearth? Talk about embarrassing. I didn't listen when Gesan tried to stop me. I thought I could handle it. But I just ended up losing my favorite bow to those stupid things. I thought I was fully fledged. But there's probably no way I could have gotten back on my own. Mm. I bet now you see why we were treating you like a small chick. And they're so... So, uh... <gasps> mean to him still. You were right. It's really important to work as a flock. It's a good message in this quest. I think I finally get what dad has been trying to tell me all this time. Mm. Is that all there is to the story? It seems unlike you let your bow be taken to him. <gasps> Oh yeah, funny story about that. There was this whole thing with Princess Zelda. I spotted her getting attacked by a monster. It was such a surprise that I dropped my guard and it stole my bow. But I guess she was fine because then she zoomed up above the cloud and became light. Uh, Princess Zelda flew above the cloud. How can that be? Hmm, seems like a stretch, but we're not going to get to the bottom of, bottom of it sitting around here. Tulin. Link came out here looking for Princess Zelda. You should go with him and investigate the cloud. You say the princess soared into. <laughs> huh? But I thought I wasn't allowed. Ah. I got a report before coming here. We think it's likely that the blizzard is coming from inside the cloud after all. The ah. call is coming from inside the house. Oh, what that meme is about. Uh, the only way is through that top. Uh, I want to see for myself as soon as I can, but the strong winds make any approach from the sides impossible. The only way in is through the top, but... But what? There's not a Rito alive cap capable of crossing the stormy sky and making it all the way there. Well, except for one. I'm talking about you, Tulin. Okay, so they, they think he's too childish to, to fight some enemies, but he's, he's not child... Child enough to to take on the the most powerful storm ever seen by them. <laughs> That's a bit unreasonable uh, in the logic, I would say. Only you have the skill and training to create gusts at will. Tulin will be the finest Rito warrior of all once he understands the value of working with his oh. allies. You know who said that to me? Your old dad, Tiba. Huh. And dad say that? Oh. Yep. And I'll make sure he knows what you accomplished here today. Now it's time you go with Link to find Princess Zelda and whatever causing this blizzard. No problem. The two of us together have got this. We got it, bro. I saw Princess Zelda up on the Sky Island near Hebra Peak. Let's check there first. Link, Tulin, we're counting on you. Rusty Claymore, nothing to have. Is this a good bow? Looks like a good bow. Uh, a falcon bow. It travels even further at aerial combat. Nice. Let's drop this one before it breaks. I'm ready when you are, dude. Are we going where exactly? Go with Tulin to the Sky Island above Hebra Peak, where the claims he saw. Oh, this... Oh, it's those islands. Okay. So, dude, can you help me? Let's go. I want a gust that way. <laughs> that was a bit fail. So here we should be able to ascend. Forget that I need to confirm that I want to go up as well. Oh, 
Ah, a little chest. Didn't anticipate that. A Sonite sword. I'm not gonna take it, actually. We have enough things at the moment. Nice little boost. I like that power. I should... Will we have that power the rest of the game now? That would be crazy good, actually. So far up, this thing. Yes, we can go there. But I also want to see this dude. Uh, it's a Kuroko seed that needs help. I wonder where he needs help to. Where is your friend then? If it's far, I'm not gonna help you for now. Okay, that's really easy. Yeah. I cannot catch up. Or maybe it's not easy. Uh, it's nearby at least. So let's take you. Oh. Let's see how far we can just... And yeah, that's not enough. So let's see what we have... What Sonya devices we got. We actually got this one. Let's take one of each out. And one fire as well. Okay. Take out. And take out. Oh! Only one, please. Oh no! My thingy fell. Oh. <laughs> Why stand here at the, like the smallest place? Just throw him down. Boom. And the wings as well. Perfect. Okay, let's start building. One platform. And uh, where's the fiery thing? Boom. Oh my god. You are important. Put you all... But not in the middle, because the middle should be saved for the... I forgot to attach you. We can attach you later. Middle is reserved for this. I'm not sure if this is actually a good plan, <laughs> but we're gonna try. It feels like it might be a okay plan at least. Oh my god. Boom. Get this dude over here. Why not just attach you there? No. Then we will attach you wherever. Hope you don't... Sure. Okay, now it works. Oh, that's that was not smart. Okay, we need some extra energy for being able to do this. I'm just gonna munch on some of these. And then let's just keep standing here until we. Now we only have one problem. How can I steer this thing? Yes. No. Nice, the wind helps us. Nice. Big brain move. <laughs> oh, and now I actually just gonna secure this. 
No, no, do, do. I'm stupid. God damn, boy. <sighs> that was not the brightest thing I have ever I've done. Ah, <laughs> oh, freaking hell. Okay, but now we know that our plan is at least working. So let's just drop it. No. Oh my. <laughs> there it goes. <sighs> yeah, I'm not sure what I deserved after that. <laughs> oh, and there you are. Do we have enough to build another one? We do. Let's just do that instead. Alive now. And will my bird friend come with me now? Don't get stuck here, dude. Okay. But this. Now we actually might be able to. Are you joking me? I have the the best luck at the moment. Can you jump up here? I need you on this. Maybe I just... Like this, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, boom. It's good, it's a learning experience. You have to fail to learn. And now we can use your power any second there. Yeah, I guess we have to push ourselves backwards first. <laughs> oh, I just did this. This made... I made it so much harder than it would have been. I need to munch on some more of these. And... Oh, you're... And where are you now? Where is my friend? Hey. Okay. Let's do this again. And this time... We're gonna manage. Give me... Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, this is a bit scary. And then we're actually gonna. And this time. No, don't freaking fall down again. <clears throat> I'm too tilted for that. I'm gonna leave him. <laughs> I'm way too... No, no. We're not too tilted for this. Let's just... Grab this thingy. Okay. Just... Take a quick little break here, because now we need to fight. Oh. I died there. Thankfully, I have some. Oh. Everything has gone wrong <laughs> these last 10 minutes. <laughs> okay. Thank you. 
Um, why not? Oh. Wow. Don't let me die here. I saw my life. Don't want to do that. Oh, need more food. <sighs> okay. Line everything up a bit better this time. So third time is the charm. They usually say that. We want a flat beginning. And that's a good angle, I guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you should... Uh, I was first going to say you should count yourself lucky that I want to help you for this long, but maybe you shouldn't because I hurt you every time I drop you out from the building. Okay, are you ready? You are ready. I am ready. I don't need this big sword. It's too hot. No, 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 no. It's good for you. It's good for you. Promise. I promise. Oh my god, it will break. It will break and he also fell down for some reason. That's annoying. And there we go. Oh, yeah. It's not meant to be, I guess. So let's just climb up this thing and then we can end the episode. That Kuroko seed took <laughs> way too long and we didn't even manage to get it. Bolt. Boom. Isn't enough? Nice. And it's the plan here that I should fly and then ascend in the air. I think so. Nice. Yeah. Let's try it out. That was not the plan. Maybe I can stand here. Yeah. Or not. I guess we have to climb the old fashioned way then. Ah. It's blind. Just climb up before the blood moon starts. Thank you. When the we can skip this. Can he send a gust upwards if I just watch look straight up? Should try soon here. Nope. 
We're soon at the top. Need some guys gonna aimbot to make my life e a bit easier. It was possible to find out what's inside that blizzard. Oh. Aww. Why? If it isn't Tulin, I was focused on the clouds to notice you. But if you come here, that means... Oh. Yep, they said I could go up Aww. here. I knew it. Something told me you were the best one for this mission. Everyone has admired your wind gust technique since you first demonstrated it. Ah. So this whole climbing thing will be for the next episode. Uh, you may be the only Rito capable of rising above the cloud to find the truth among the turbulent skies. Give it your best shot, I'll be here watching for your return. Thanks. Between Link and me, you won't be disappointed. And that will be everything we have time for today in this episode. Please like this video and comment what you think about this game so far. And also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. This has been 23. I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.